So, Kate Middleton's medical complications. Whilst they are none of our business and she's entitled to privacy, it looks like people are finally revealing what she went through and the Spanish press are documenting it. Hey guys, this is Marad Morali. Hopefully you guys are all doing well today. Back in again with another video. If you have not subscribed, what are you doing? Click that button. It is fresh content every single day on this channel. Please do subscribe to the channel and let's get into a lot of this royal frenzy that's giving me a headache at this point i'm fasting and you know i have to cover this nonsense of conversations that are going on but it seems that you know it is the top topic of today but renowned authors bertrand deckers the spanish press are reporting um a renowned author and expert on the british monarchy known for work such as i love elizabeth and les Ley Romanov has shed light on the specific circumstances surrounding the princess's surgery. Speaking to the French media outlet Voici Deckers revealed that the princess had a very serious gynecological problem that required significant major operations to be done. This clarification brings into focus the seriousness of the health issues confronting the royal family, though it's encountered by the reassurance conveyed through the conduct of the princess's sister, whose recent vacation suggests a positive outlook on Kate's recovery. I would have agreed with that sentiment of a positive recovery if this was a couple of weeks ago and she was cited by now. But I think that, you know, there seems to be a gynecological issue that she went through, major operation, my light just went out, it is what it is, major operation, let me actually turn that on. Major operation that she went through and then something went wrong with that post-operative period that she went through. And now I think that this woman is missing or unconscious or has been unalived or is no longer the Princess of Wales set to be the queen of the country for why she has not been seen, for why they're editing pictures of her and for why fake statements are being put out by William and by Kensington Palace. This is definitely William's work at hand. You can tell because it's sleazy nasty and not carefully done and overtly publicly rushed this is why you can tell this is the work of prince william and he is doing all of this whilst being silent watch how nobody's asking him where are your where are your moments of opinions on what is going on with your wife and for the fact that they are fake images and everything like when he was last asked publicly how is your wife he completely ignored the conversation this is somebody who will cover everything up not take accountability then will put up fake statements just to make sure that his hands are clean and that he doesn't have to deal with any of this this was also the man who wasn't even there for his wife when she was in hospital so i definitely am believing the spanish press at this point i feel like they have been completely validated they have credibility in my eyes far more than the palace who post fake pictures but this is basically what is being stated by authors that I don't know how they are privy to all of this information, who even tells them what goes around in this aristocratic environment. But, you know, having a serious gynecological problem and, you know, why she needed a major operation. That major operation then must have gone wrong as the Spanish press are reporting and therefore she is not healing and getting better as quicker as she needed. Why the palace weren't just transparent with this conversation from the beginning, I don't know. Because if they were transparent with everything, it would have avoided all of this. There would be no controversy, no frenzy, no where is Kate. They would have avoided all of this. Had they just been truthful with everything going on with Kate and this happened and that happened and that's why she's going to be out for much longer. They haven't even returned, confirmed a return for her because as far as I'm concerned, it was meant to be Easter. Then the tripping of the colours in June... Then the army had to back and take that off. So we don't even know when she's returning. It looks like we're just being fed lies by every single moment when it comes from the royal family. They've lost 110% credibility from me completely with the way that they have dealt with this Kate Middleton frenzy. Everything they now tell me I'm going to believe is a lie until I'm seeing proper videographic evidence from multiple angles. I'm going to believe anything they say in regards to any person of the royal family to be a complete lie. So the Spanish press are documenting and, you know, this is obviously stated by the French media outlet, but Marsa.com are Spanish press and they are revealing this um, in terms of, you know, her reasons for her operations, which have, you know, come to light. And really, guys, Prince William is just a nasty man. Nasty, selfish man. Subscribe to the channel, click that button. It is daily and consistent content. Comment down below. Give this video a thumbs up. I would appreciate it. And I'll catch you guys soon for another video.